Can't handle a couple of spliffs. <laughs> We've had more than two. Yeah, I can't remember. <laughs> <laughs> Catchers. It wasn't all about parties on December the 31st. An elderly man was on his way home when this shocking event happened. Here's the reconstruction. Hello, darling. Sorry I'm late for dinner. That's fine, Frank. It's not finished yet, anyway. Great news for a change. I'll be home soon. Love you. Oh, I love you too. Pam, no! have confirmed one of the murder weapons to have been a crowbar. It's all my fault. What am I meant to do? I feel so bad for that old couple. I had him right in front of me, but I was too interested in Rachel to think straight. Do you normally talk to yourself? How did you know I was here? Harry told me you come here sometimes. It took me a while to find you. It's quite hidden up here. Yeah, it is. I come here to think. It's very peaceful up here. It's beautiful. You shouldn't beat yourself up over this. That man has something very wrong with him. You did your best at the time. This whole event was tearing me up inside, but having Rachel next to me made me feel a lot better. We should go to the police and give a statement. That should ease your mind. That does sound like the right thing to do. I had never had someone who cared for me as much as Rachel did. I was falling for her.
Rachel was right. I did feel better after handing in a statement. Do you want to see a movie tonight? I really, really want to see Zombie Rising. I had already seen it with Mike. <laughs> it wasn't very good. But of course I wanted to spend time with Rachel. Yeah, sure. We can grab Chinese as well. That sounds good. Hey! As I saw the thief running off into the distance, I couldn't help but think normally it would have been a case of you win some, you lose some. 